His rings were perfect. The world was not. Perfection in Nern is its orcs. Sauron's notion of perfection is a low, mean thing.
see that coming! Rest! Get behind him! Now! Rest! Fancy moves you've got! 
single pink skin like you, but I'll show him how it's done! fire that you created, but I was born anew as the flame, not the flame of knowledge, not the flame of truth, oh no, I am the flame of war! Yes! 
Let's fight! Yeah! <laughs> 
The old gods abandoned us and the music of the world was thrown into disarray. He saw it as his mission to set it right. One dark lord correcting the mistakes of another. The future is filled with them. Each one determined to save the world from itself. To purge the chaos. To rule all. After Morgoth came Sauron, and after Sauron... After Sauron will come peace. To see beyond the limit of ordinary vision has always fascinated us. Those who claim to scry say pools of still water held in an antique bowl can foresee Mordor's many dangers, or reveal a glimpse of fair Gondor itself. But the bowl lacks the range or clarity of the Palantir, and I wonder whether it shows us anything beyond what we might wish to be true. Could the old scry of such a bowl? Yes. And doing so was safer than using a palantir, because the visions travel in only one direction. Every author seeks to inspire, some seek to instruct. So it is with Contrivances of Carpentry by Pelwyn of Lossenark. I spent many an hour tracing the wondrous diagrams within this tome, instructions for building everything from hobby horses to windmills to catapults. I wonder sometimes who taught more printers carpenters, Pelwyn or his book? As a lad, I was always fascinated by woodwork. 
turning boards into furniture, a home. Italian the craftsman. That I'd have liked to see. Those who live in Gondor's lowlands could easily forget how close to Mordor Minas Ethel was. Few of Gondor's people devote more than a moment's thought to its borders, or what lies beyond. For them, the threat of Mordor is distant indeed. I've never seen a map of Gondor so detailed. Yet look at how little your people know of other lands. To rule, one must be willing to destroy everything that has come before you. Even the memory of it must be purged. Do not think of what is lost. Think only of what will be. This is the story the Dark Lord tells himself. This is the story that will bring an end to Middle Earth.
She learned from Sauron as I did. She survived him as I did. Then there is wisdom in these words. Some see rings like this as mere adornment, decoration for one's finger. Yet this ring marks its wearer as a Lord of Gondor, the line of Hamasir. Its filigrees form a seal that marks correspondence as surely as a signature. This ring may be all that's left of Hamasir's nine. I know they perished when Minisethal fell. When a ring has symbolic significance, it is far more powerful than ordinary jewelry. The Hamasir family. I knew them. A long time ago. I doubt they have any further use for it. Go to the forest of Karnan. Something calls me. Not all calls should be answered, Talion. You know what we're going to find in here, don't you? As much as anyone can know. Free, right? 
She's picking us off, one by one. That beast, scum, hundred strong. Get out here and show yourself. Pit to peak, enslave it our rivers and trees. No, 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 no. I take it this is the work of Khan. This is the forest of Khanan. And she will protect it with the full power of nature. This forest is possessed by death as much as life. The two are bound together. That is Kanan. What are the orcs doing here? They are doing Sauron's work. You have no idea what you've walked into. <laughs> You'll never make it out of here alive. Or did. Oh, whatever you are. <laughs> what is she? The cows? The ghouls? She's all of it. Feed, you will feed a thousand mouths. Why do these beasts not attack us? They hear her song. They are part of her as she is part of them. Yet they will defend. She is watching us. No. She's drawing us in. This Karnan has been busy. Where are you? differences in here in here we're just food I found it the tree she's the tree spirit of Conan is tree and beast fang and claw root and spear oh. <laughs> wasn't there before. Oh, <laughs> 
of Mordor. This is also nature. In all its fury. Can you tell it to stop? One does not reason with the wind. Seems this Karnan isn't as powerful. <laughs> And rise again. In a hole go you. What have we unleashed? The cry of the forests. The scream of the rivers. Great spirit of Khan. See so cry and clamor. You have woke. and creviced until now. I opened the dark lord. He stokes its flames. Forges cage like kindling for shattering fire to come. Burn you. Burn we. A fire for all it will be. What have we awoken? Undead! 
Ringmaker, your forge sings. A crack across the land. Fire woken by a cold metal ring. We hear your call. Allow us to help. Yes, you will. You, a flesh-haunted thing. We will find Tor Goros. Go now. Your Balrog waits. He rises in doom shadow. Fight till death and rise again. You will fight. Soon and soon. Death will defeat undead. It seems this ring has woken more of sorrow. Yes, we must go to Golgoloth and deal with this Balrog. Minasethal's bookshelves cannot compare to the great libraries of Minas Tirith, but they're still the biggest collection of knowledge for miles in any direction. As a girl, I thrilled at the wisdom gathered here. Everything from histories to poetry to cookbooks from a bygone age. This one, Tales of Farthest Umbar, was a childhood favorite. Stories of daring from pirates of old. Real Corsairs are far less noble than these tales make them out to be, I'm sure. But they can't be as cruel as the orcs. Make you stronger. When I became a ranger, I thought I'd see the entire world. It is much the same everywhere. The ambitious striving against the dull. Yeah. <laughs> 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 